Hello and welcome back to Promise Gaming and Star Wars Rebellion. Okay. We are colonizing bits of the Outer Rim, trying to make up for our resource um, deficit, which has been kind of costing us a bit. We're also kind of upgrading our infrastructure around the core world so we can start building up fleets and such a little bit faster. That'll be good. I'm hoping, hoping, hoping that we can try taking one of these worlds. Corson probably is the most likely of the uh, the bunch to be taken down. We're working on a Mon Calamari cruiser right now. That honestly probably was not a good choice. Probably a little bit too long. But um, I probably should have gotten stuff to focus down TIE Fighters since that's our primary opposition. But it, it'll be okay. It will be okay. It's fine. It's fine. What are you guys worried about? I played this game for so long when I was a kid. How could I possibly be wrong? Our goal has been achieved. It's just, it's, it's, it's inconceivable. It's inconceivable. Okay. Uh, mines deployed. Diplomacy. Trollis is doing good. Trollis is done. Let's go to Corfi. Now that I know what's here... I'm really going to want to take this guy down, too. This is a, definitely the next, like, target as far as beating the enemy down. I want to take Zyquin. I do. I really, really, really do. I'm thinking in order to do that, we'll finish off these Corellian gunships. I'm hoping four will be enough to deal with seven TIE Fighters. Should be. If one Corellian Corvette can take on four TIE Fighters, I would think that four gunships should be able to deal with it. But we'll find out. This will be done in just seven days. So let's speed this along. Fleet arrives at Daltar. Oops. Uh, Leia Organa. Meh, nothing interesting happening there. Okay. Whoop. Kabindi joins. Okay. That's nice, I guess. Um, Mom Moth made herself useful up here. So we're automatically building up some garrisons in that area. Let's start working on things that can hold troops. What can hold troops? Well, the transports can obviously hold troops. Uh, can I, can these? No, that holds fighters. Not a lot, honestly, that can hold troops at this point. A bulk transport can. They can hold six troops. That's probably the most cost-effective way to deal with things right now, so we'll do that. Okay, so I'm thinking then... No, we don't want this bulk transport going here. We'll make it its own fleet. Look, just go to Corellia for now. Okay. The Union Jack pushing daisies. The, um... Uh... <laughs> I'm terrible at coming up with names on the spot. The Logitech? That doesn't really fit in the Star Wars universe. But what do you care? And, um... The Falcon... Crest. Yes. These four ships are going to go to Zyquin, and in just a few days, we will find out if they blow up or not, basically, is what it comes down to. Kothlis, anything exciting here? Befesh could use a bit of upgrading, so do that. Three. There you go. I'm going to do three at a time here. Why? It doesn't take long, and I'm not building anything at the moment, so I don't care. Let's save myself a little bit of micromanagement. Gorman. Let's actually destroy these two training facilities and replace them with advanced training facilities, like so. That'll help. Uh, you! I actually would like you to build some advanced shipyards up here. There already is one, and the reason I want that is because I would like an extra troop transport That'll actually start colonizing some of the worlds as needed, if needed. Hard to say that it will be needed at all. Scrap. Upgrade a little bit more. There we go. Okay, when are these guys going to arrive? Three days. Let's hope that there's no Star Destroyers there. Okay. Nope, just TIE Fighters. One, two, three, four... Oops, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I think we can handle it. Let's do it. Ugh, I hate that error message. Okay. The fleet is ready, Admiral. What are your orders? Alright, Task, Task Force, Force 1 and 2. Attack Task Force two acknowledges the TIE assignment. Fighters. I'm gonna have you guys stick together. You can actually tell them to, like, follow some, like, trajectories and kind of move around the map. 
Uh, it's not really that useful. Honestly, more often than not, it's better just to sort of rush in and just go guns blazing. It's the better way to do things. All right. Come on, guys. Open fire. Take out the uh, take out the TIE Fighters. There's only, eight, there's only seven of them. This ship is being targeted. The Union Jack is being targeted hard. Okay. Well... It doesn't seem to be affecting us much. Our shields are doing just fine. And the four of them are focused firing these TIE Fighters pretty gosh darn effectively. Yeah, TIE Fighters are worthless in the mid-game. Honestly, the Empire should be up... Whoa, that would... this guy's just zipping by, isn't he? They're moving pretty fast. Honestly, yeah. They should be focusing on TIE Interceptors and stuff by now. I don't know if they're just really slow or what, but... There we go. Okay. Can you take out the last TIE Fighter, please? One more. Come on. There we go. There we go. Alright. So at this point... Now we get to have a little fun. What do we want to do? Do we want to try and capture people? It's not a bad idea. First off, let's send the four of them to get on the Logitech. I don't care which one, really. I'm going to send all of my Bothan spies to go on an espionage mission. I don't really care if I lose any. Um, that just because, what the heck, they've got very little detection at this point. Enemy missions at... Ooh, they're trying to abduct people at Balmora. We need to keep They know some people are there. Which means I probably should be paying attention to who's there. I probably should move these guys, shouldn't I? That said, we are actually in pretty good shape still. No, no, I'll hold on to it for now. I will hold on to this. How are we doing on this uh, ship? We're doing we're doing pretty darn okay. Um Hmm. I'm thinking Bevel Lemonisk is capable of all three design. Getting him is going to be a massive blow to the Empire. Of course, I could just stop all research by just destroying those two facilities. And that's probably the better way to go. Sabotage those, nothing they can do. A couple of mines deployed. Corellia. Um, to the Pushing Daisies, I would like you to send some infiltrators. Five will do fine. It'll only take a few days to train those up. Go ahead and just manage production for a little bit. There you go. Oh, wait. We can also explore a little bit more. Ryloth, home of the Twi'leks. Why do I know that? Because I have no life. It's the primary reason. Personnel arrive. Training facilities are idle. Don't care. Hmm. Yeah, okay, okay. Let's send all these guys to destroy the shipyard. Tura, you're our decoy. Whoop! Balmora, what do we got? Well, we have a lot of defense against... Oof, that's a lot. They actually have some troops, which distresses me a little bit. We retreated, apparently. Oh my gosh, they destroyed all of our ships. The Hustler survived, thank God. Did you destroy anything? We destroyed a bunch of their TIE Fighters. And that's it. We just damaged some ships. Oh boy. It's not a good place to be. They left. Thank God they did leave. But we're not in the best position right now. I think we need a lot more Mon Calamarian regiments here at Balmora. Those are great at defense, and I don't want to get bombarded or anything. Fortunately, we had a shield. So even though we lost a lot, and I do mean a lot, because we kind of wanted to use this fleet to capture some stuff. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We lost a lot of people. People were injured. People were captured. Bad stuff happened. Really bad stuff has happened at Zyquin. That is distressing. Okay. Okay. Ah, uh, huh. All right, all right. Well, we have only one option, I think, at this point, and that is to conquer the planet. We're going to have to free these people. How are we going to do that? Stop with the infiltrators. Useless to me. Commodore. Train Wookiees. 
Now, Wookiees have uh, an attack strength of eight. So they're actually pretty good. Let's get six of them. They're all going to go on my bulk transport. A transport ship filled with angry, angry Wookiees. That's going to do all my fighting for me. They're pretty good in that sense. Let's get some more construction yards going. Yeah, I need to free these guys. Okay, so, so who is here? I swear, same thing happened when I was, um... I got Chewbacca stuck here. Somebody is here and doing a really stinking good job of detecting. We did it's it! It's irritating me. It needs to end. I don't know what's going on. Alright, let's let the nimble join up here. You can hold six troops, ten fighters. Let's go to Umgul. And we'll start training some Wookiees up here as well. Yeah, yeah, that'll be good. We have six advanced training facilities there, so that won't be a problem. Yeah, these six Wookiees are probably going to be used to take down Bothawi. You could probably do that, right? Let's go ahead and start constructing some more um, Corellian gunships. Because those are good against TIE Fighters, and I know I'm going to have a few of those hanging around, so let's deal with it. Gorman. Uh, I never did get to build my advanced training yards, because while they were in transit, the Empire interrupted it, which means they never got delivered. That's unfortunate. Let's fix that. Fleet arrives at Uvenna. Shipyard idle on Commodore. The Hustler is going to have to go to Bortress and get repaired. How long until this is finished? 11 days, and we're going to have a Mon Calamari cruiser ready to go. That's, that's good. That is definitely good. So, it'll take 42 days to build another one. Let's do it. We don't have enough refineries, apparently. We have a lot of raw materials starting to build up. Not enough refineries. It's going to be important. Corfi is doing good. Fleet arrives at Bortress. Um, Corfi is almost done. Uh, boy. Okay. Well, this has been unfortunate. Gorman, these planets all used to like us a lot. Having lost that battle was a big deal. Hey, Luke's back! Event is under blockade. Not for long, it's not. I'm ready for duty. He's back. He's stronger. We're good to go. He's grown in the Force. So basically, every time, every time that uh, Luke grows in the Force, his stats across the board go up. Right now, he was a, he's a Jedi student. He used to be a trainee. Every time he has a close call with the Emperor or Darth Vader, his Force rating goes up as long as he's not captured, and his stats get a lot better. His combat is now arguably some of the best in the game. I'm going to have him go on diplomacy you here, you go on diplomacy there, you go on diplomacy there. There we go. We'll do it. Let's see if we can get these people to like us again. It's been, uh, it's been a rough, it's been rough having lost that. It has been rough. Rishi. Scrap. Scrap. I don't feel like micromanaging anymore, so I'm just going to, I'm just going to get rid of all four of the regular shipyards. Rishi will build four. There we go. Okay. We need more refineries, though, is what we need. Infiltrators deployed. That's not going to do us a lot of good at this point. Uh, go ahead and manage production for a little while. I don't feel like dealing with it. Manage shipyard. Corfi. Our mission was successful. Mission was successful. Diplomacy. Uvena. We're doing pretty good there. Uvena's back to normal already. That was no problem. Gorman. Oop. Mon Mothma. Our goal has been achieved. Leia. We did it! Probably good at Slew Spawn now. Yeah, we are. Okay. Go to Umgul and I start swaying them doing. back. How are the Wookiees doing? They're still under construction. They're taking longer than I thought they would, to be honest. I kind of figured that'd be done really quickly, but it didn't happen. That's fine. That is fine. Not worried. Balmora, you got your training facilities on the way. That's good, because we're going to need it. Um... I feel like there was something else, but I don't remember what it was. How are these doing? They're going to be done in just a few days. We will have a whole bunch of Corellian gunships being sent off there. Good, our guy healed over Zyquin. Oops. Our mission was successful. That's good news, Luke. Well done. I'm glad that you did something useful. You used to suck horribly. Now you're actually practical. Uh, okay. The four of these guys are not going to be able to accomplish much of anything. I'm going to make you an admiral. 
I believe that having a leader in your fleet or your ground army is going to give everybody kind of a passive boost. I'm not positive about that, to be honest, but we'll see. Um, we're going to call this the Always Packing, because it's going to be packing a whole bunch of Wookiees. What a, what a hilarious idea. Who thought of this? I did. I thought of this. It was funny. Uh, I won't name that Mon Calamari Cruiser yet. Actually, yes, I will. I'm going to name it the Pike. Pike. There we go. All right. That'll be nice. When is this going to be done? Not for a while, unfortunately, but we'll make do with what we got. Bothawi, you are very tempting. I want to take that. I want to take that more than you know. It's a very tempting concept. How are we doing here? Bordy has some of the refineries on the way. It's taking a lot longer to build this stuff than I thought. I feel like I've been sitting here kind of on a um, fast pace for longer than usual, and it's still not doing much. Fortress is in good shape. Let's get Chandrilla back. Then it's just a mining world. Fortress. Oh, hang on. We finished with the Mon Calamari cruiser here. What am I going to call you? I'm going to call you the Viceroy. There you go. Oh, hang on. Who's over here? Uh-oh. When are you arriving? In just a couple of days. You've got troops. I have some troops as well. I need to retreat. I do. I do need to retreat. So we're going to get all of our guys to Balmora. There we go. Um, Bortress is a little more vulnerable than I would like at this point. I really, really hope they do not decide to attack. They might, and I have just enough troops that I might be able to hold it off. But we'll see. Okay, they've arrived. Are they attacking? Just under blockade for now. Usually, usually the AI invades immediately if they're going to, so... Uh, oh gosh, dang it, what am I calling this? The Minnow. Did I spell that right? I don't even know. And guess what? I don't even care. Don't even care. So we're gonna send a couple of on Calamari regiments there. We're gonna explore... Oh, Lando Calrissian. How's it going, buddy? Been a while. How you doing? Doing alright? The only black man in the universe! As said by, um, Family Guy once upon a time. Brilliant gunship. We did it! Good. Balmora should be fine as far as diplomacy is concerned. No, it's not! Man, he's not- he may be being successful every time, but it's not going up very quickly. Alright, Bortress. I could build more Mon Calamari cruisers, or I could build other stuff. Taking some Corellian gunships. Five of them will do. I know that's a lot, but at this point, I feel like I need it. I definitely feel like I need it. Gotta take out those TIE Fighters. They've got a little too many for me. Um, it's difficult enough handling their capital ships, but TIE Fighters, once they're swarming, that's just that's a lot of targets I'm gonna have to hit. Gorman is doing fine. Um, you know what? At our Talon, go to Bortress and do some ship design. That's the only thing left at this point, right? We'll go ahead and continue to explore. Stop managing production you? for a little while. I, hope you found my I want to see how this is going to work out for us. Uh, it's really, really, really unfortunate that uh, we lost that fleet, because it would have been nice to hold on to it. I could have taken a planet by now, but that was very, very unfortunate how that turned out for us. Very unfortunate indeed. Umgul is getting close to done here. Oh, oh, they attacked. They attacked. Uvena. Oh, they got Uvena, didn't they? They did. They took Uvena. Okay. That's just too much of a fleet. That's too many victory victory uh, cruisers for me to deal with at this point. It's too much. I need to take that. But there's not much I can do. What I could do, <laughs> I could go on a massive sabotage run. You know what? You know what? We're going to do that, but we're going to do it next episode. So thank you guys so much for watching. This has been Provis. 
Things are not going super well. We're, we're taking too long to build up, and they're starting to get a foothold, and I, I feel like there's not much I can do right now. But I'm working on it. Uh, if you have any ideas, by all means, put them in the comments section, and subscribe if you haven't already. I'll see you guys next time.